Hi, so today we're here, we're in the village of Castillo de Lucadum, we're actually in the centre, so we're close to all the amenities in walking distance. We're going to be visiting this property, it's actually over four floors and uh, it's pretty typical Spanish, so let's go take a look. As we're walking off the street, we have this large hallway area, plenty of space for hanging those jackets. As we go to the left, we have this old original storeroom, which actually has a fireplace. Still very original, not been touched, floors, walls. And what we're going to do is before we visit the main house, we're going to go down to the basement. This has got lots of potential where you could, you could actually make it into another living area. So like a separate apartment. I mean, the rooms just keep going on and on. And what this does is it actually gives us direct access out onto a indoor patio. What this house has is plenty of space. And as we mentioned, or as I said before, the potential to be made into something great. Now as you work your way out onto the patio, just borrowed your head, you will see that we have these stairs. So they'll make more sense as we go up to the next level, but these are pretty much access that you can get from directly out of the kitchen. So when when we go up you'll you'll understand the layout better. Okay? So let's go back. The properties are on mains water and mains electric and also the sewage goes to the mains, the main drain. So if you want to work your way up the stairs you'll find that we've got a nice little living room up there so please, after you. Off this living room, we have a corridor, and the way that it's been made is that they've actually put a bedroom on this level. So if you wanted it to, you could actually knock through and make it all as a one big, large um, kitchen, diner, living room. This is the traditional kitchen, obviously they've Put some cupboards in so it isn't made by hand. Not too bad at all in size. And this is the access. And if you just remember that we were looking at the steps going up, this is the access that we've got onto this terrace from the patio. So from here now, we've got a bathroom. This is a nice modern bathroom, ready to use. And the, the actual water boiler is gas, okay, just to let you know. So from here now what we're going to do is we're going to go up to the next level and take a look at the rest of the bedrooms. So as you come up the original staircase, we've got this fantastic bedroom to the back. This actually looks out onto the patio. Um, it's got some amazing features. I mean, the original flooring is in pristine condition. Okay, not everybody loves these floors, but hey, they're original. If they're in good condition, keep them. So we've got one bedroom here, and then we've got this bedroom. So on this level, there's two. Don't forget, we've already seen another one downstairs, which is the third. And from here, we're going to go up these stairs and go up to the final level. So now you come up the last lot of stairs. Let's start in this room. Put yourself a nice little open fire. 
Again, this upstairs area is it's not really been touched, so it was used for storage, used for keeping the food for the animals. It's got a spectacular view over the mountains. Just to give you an idea. And I mean, this, this area itself, you could easily convert, okay? If you want to continue through, we've got these other two rooms. Again, nice high ceilings. Those let me in plenty of natural light. And personally, what I would do up here is move the rooms around, maybe make it into a master with a, an ensuite, because don't forget the house has only got one bathroom at this moment in time. But at the end of the day, you can still live here, even though it is older, it's still in really good condition. It's got the potential, it's got the space, and hey, that's what everybody's looking for. So that's the end of the tour. If you want any more details, you want to come and visit, you want to go and click that, you know, the reserve button, then please go ahead and do get in contact with us and we are here to help.